We're out at Deltona today for spring football. We're here with defensive lineman Traquan McNair and the new quarterback for the Wolves, Dylan Torres, who was at Pine Ridge last year. Dylan, how have you acclimated yourself to your new team and ultimately what's new, what's different with this group than uh, the one you're at before? We're building trust. You know, every day you come in, you gotta, you gotta build a foundation for success. You come in, you don't wanna you know, step on people's feet, figuratively speaking. You come in and you, set up, you lead by example. I saw intensity, people want to win, people come out here and they have one goal. And we play as if we have one goal. At the end of the day, it's defense versus offense, but we're one family. We will never go at each other. What did you see out of this group last year on the other side over at Pine Ridge? And you know how difficult is it to try to get away from guys like Traquan and Bobby Cotton and some of the defenders they got, even in practice? Well, honestly, they're fundamentally sound. They come in, they work, they know what they got to do, they know their assignments. They don't do too much, they don't do, and they don't do enough. Like, what they do is what they do their job. And at the end of the day, they do what they have to do to make plays. And when, when the coach says one thing, they do what they have to do. Trey, what kind of expectations do you have for yourself and, and of this group this year, uh, with a lot coming back on defense especially? I'll try to get all team, first team, you know. Um, trying to, just trying to get better as a person. You know, as a leader, because I got to be a leader now after all them, you know, top leaders that came, Logan, Schaefer, Foots, um, all them, you know, so I got to try to just be a leader, and that's it. Yeah, what have you tried to learn from some of those guys that are gone now, Jalen Monroe, Devon McCullough, uh, some of the guys in your secondary from a couple of years ago when you guys were really strong defensively? You've started for this team for the last couple seasons, so what have you tried to take leadership-wise from those guys? Just being more vocal, um, you know, listening to the coaches, Making sure I tell guys, you know, what to do, make sure they do what they're supposed to in the weight room and everything, and just do what I'm supposed to as well and, be, and do my part. You went down to the opening camp for uh, in Miami for regionals. You know, what was that experience like, and how do you feel like that can help you get better as a player? You know, I did I did good on, like, the drills. I need to step more. I need to work on. But, the, like, all the other stuff, like one-on-ones, one-on-ones, I, I beat everybody there, you know. I went against everybody and, and dominated, so. I think I did good as a, as a person. When he's saying one, he's beating everybody on one-on-ones, Dylan, when you see him in practice, is that matching up? And is, and is it making it a little bit more intimidating to try to learn offense when you got that guy bearing down on you? I mean, you can look at my side. I don't think I'm intimidated by anyone. But seeing him across the field, it just know, I just know that I have to step up my game and I have to be more focused. And coach gets on me in practice and stuff like that, but it's just he wants me to be better because he knows that I have D1 talent coming at me every single day. And that's a blessing in disguise because when I go drop back to pass in real games, I'm already going to be accustomed to athletes coming at me every which way. What do you feel like this offense is capable of and what kind of identity do you want to establish? You know, we're capable of anything. We throw the ball, run the ball, we can power it down, we can counter people, we can toss it up. I mean, what we can do is not even substantial enough for anybody to realize. We're actually, we have many formations. We line up, play fundamental sound football, and we move the ball three yards a play, three yards a play. We don't have to throw the ball up. We don't have to throw the ball deep every single play. We move the ball, and we dominate.